G'day. Well, next week's going to be Harmony Week, and I'm at the Migration Museum, which is a great place just to remind ourselves of the migrant history of this country and reflect on our own origins. You know, you don't have to look too far back in anyone's family tree to realise that we all have some migrant history. In Harmony Week, we've got a great opportunity to celebrate cultural diversity. And generally at Dipti, what we do is we put on an event and we have some food, which is a great way to get a window into another culture. But it's also an opportunity to reflect on us as a society and us as individuals and how we value each other. We're very fortunate to live in a multicultural society in Australia and the great diversity in our community is a real strength. It also reflects in our organisation where we aspire to have a workforce that reflects the cultural diversity of the community that we serve. So this week, let's take the time to celebrate the cultural diversity inside of Dipti, but let's also pause and recommit to the elimination of discrimination. Because from time to time, we might hear a discriminatory comment or observe a behaviour that's not quite right because it's directed at someone by virtue of their appearance or their culture. If you hear that, my expectation is you call it out, you intervene and you actually do something about it. And let me be clear, we will take any issue of this nature very seriously. We have very firm policy guidelines. We have lots of things written about this, but I am committed to making sure that we put it into action, that we have a workplace where we not only celebrate our cultural diversity, but we eliminate discrimination.